Madam Speaker, I'm very excited to rise today and speak about our amazing, our incredible, our outstanding, and they won last night's playoff game three to two, Winnipeg Jets. <laughs> Speaker, we know that the Winnipeg Jets are much more than just a hockey team. A few fun facts. Because of the True North Foundation, did you know that members of the Jets go into schools during I Love to Read Month and read to students? Did you know that they arrange hockey camps for youth? And did you know that they go to the children's hospital to read and get to know the children? Madam Speaker, we need to acknowledge that our team is the best. They're amazing players. Their families are fantastic. And all of our fans, we sure have a lot to be proud of. Now, Madam Speaker, I'm not very musically inclined. And I'm not quite as skilled as the member from Transcona in creating my own lyrics. However, yesterday I heard something from our friends at 103 Virgin Radio, and I could sure use the help of my colleagues here in the house by saying, Go Jets, go! Go Jets, go! Go Jets, go! Go Jets, go! From the north end to Old St. V, throw them hands up and dance with me. Ask around and they know Peg City. Ask around and we say Peg City. Everybody chanting, go Jets, go! Four lines deep everywhere we roll. Ask around and we know Peg City. Ask what's good and we say Peg City. Mic drop. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Thank you, colleagues. And good luck to our Jets. Go Jets, go!